Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Graven. I'm back with more reactions with an X. This time doing another episode of Shaman King. I believe we're actually on episode seven or eight. Well, we're about to see what episode we're on. In any case, I'm excited. It's uh, the new 2021 version, so the animation is different. The story is a little bit differently play paced. It's a little faster. I think it's been pretty good actually the first couple episodes were a little too fast in my opinion but i understand they wanted to get to the tournament and get going since they've hit the more tournament centric story plot stuff it really has been well paced well animated the stories are good the music is good i'm enjoying the shit out of it and we're about to meet one of my favorite characters from the whole series so i hope that everybody else is enjoying it Big shout out to anybody watching here on Twitch. I appreciate you all. And super big shout out to anybody watching on Patreon. You guys will be able to watch this whenever you want with the full audio and video. No cuts like I have to do later. And it'll stay up unlike on Twitch where it just goes down after a couple days. So, yeah. Well, I think that's pretty much everything. So we're going to get into this episode. Uh, come and say hi and chat with us as always here on the Discord. That is actually a interesting way they put it in. I still got the weed shirt. This is how most graves are. Oh, yeah, that. It's, I forgot that they actually explain a lot of the stuff behind this. Yeah, wrecked. Yep, I forgot they're fighting in a cemetery, too. This is cool. This was a very interesting, like, change of the Faust mis Faustus mythos. I like the voice for Faust. A bit of an oddball. I love the little that they did that was actually interesting honestly this character is too big brain for this anime it's too big brain for all of us what is in that is that like a Oh my god. I will say, Faust is actually, uh, really big brain. Just saying, like, you might, you might not like him by the end of this episode, but he's big brain. Interesting. Eliza. This is this was actually insane in the manga and in the thing. Like what he does here was was actually wild. Like I'm not gonna lie, if they show it, that's They didn't show it. <laughs> Let me tell you, your doctor doesn't appreciate being hit from behind. To be fair, he did attack first by surprise. I can't believe they didn't show it. He he straight up sex him open. Like he doesn't cut his bone, but he like pulls his chest uh skin open and like pins it with the forceps and stuff. Oh, interesting text up there they have. That was dope. See, that one was cool. See how they've done them and then they've put the translation so you can have the original languages one and that one. This is dope. They've fixed the problem I had with last episode already. Fight. They don't take damage no matter what you do, even if you break them apart. I mean, even if you shatter the tibias, right? Like, 
he can may theoretically have them pushed together in different places. It's just like, especially the way necromancers are, it could be crazy. See, and he's put a time limit on him. I can't believe they didn't show it. That, that was That's pretty much my only note so far with this episode. Ah, look at the face. That's that's dope. Now that there's the translation and the name, that's so cool. That's true. At the end of the day, he's got to beat this dude. How the f should I know? <laughs> I still want to know what's up with that bullet. I don't think know if we ever got an explanation. I can't remember. Or was it in part of her thing, actually? Yeah. Get fucked! Oof! Told you, man, he's big brain. A smooth brain's like us and Yo can't can't even start to calculate the plan. We just we we run in and fight. Yeah, you gotta block it with. Ooh. Oh, jeez. Dolls plague. Uh oh, he's gonna piss him off. He's gonna piss him off. He's playing the big brain games. The big brain games begin. But us smooth brains can play too. Get him! Look at the little Faust. Look at it. Look at the little glasses. I love little Faust. Took her legs out. No. Not her beautiful legs. Yep. I'm not gonna lie, this one was another one that was a little bit fast. Just in certain spots. Cause like they're they're building up for this kind of like self-reflection thing to lead into the next battle with uh Ren. Oh, probably shouldn't have said that, but if you're watching you probably know. As Faust Angry Faust. I do remember who comes up here. This is pretty funny. I told you, Faust is a badass. Look at him. And then there comes the next episode's one. Look at his weird ass little... Oh, that's right. He's obsessed with milk in this part. They didn't show that. They showed that in the earlier stuff, but they skipped all this by going fast. Yep. So there was the reveal. 
Uh, I think that was pretty good, guys. I honestly enjoyed it a lot. But, uh, I will say that it, that episode was another one where I felt like, oh, god damn, really? Can we not Netflix just play immediately? Please, no. But it was another one that I felt was a little bit rushed. Uh, and that's no offense to it. I mean, it is what it is. But I do really feel like some of these episodes, even maybe the, it's not just the fact that they're one episode, but the the way they're framed or pulled in the story feels like the story is rushed or just doesn't give the impact that it absolutely could and should give in some of those really heavy parts based on that. Like that part of learning and getting better for uh, Yo is actually a really big character development where you're like, you, you slowly realize like, yeah, he did care and he does have this like feeling of wanting to do better and be better and become the Shaman King for his friends and for these people that he is now taking on their dreams right like horo horo and uh eventually like faust and everybody else cut not everybody but a good portion of the people he's just like yeah i'll just take on their dream so it's gonna be interesting to see i did think it was very funny that they had this this double one up and i think that it was very hard to like display that correctly in anime as opposed to manga where you can do this double one up of like all right on the manga page you have one panel whole page spread where it's like faust with this giant thing and it's like another page where it's like oh god it's faust what are we gonna do and then another half page leading up and then another big page with ren taking it out where in this it's like literally 30 seconds of the same thing so there's less like i feel like build to the double reveal but i do think it's still dope to see with that said i want to give a big shout out to everybody watching especially to the people who watch on patreon you guys mean the world to me and for as low as a dollar you're able to watch the full audio full video so if you're seeing this thank you guys so much uh you know appreciate you for everyone else i also appreciate you watching whether it's on twitch or youtube you can catch us weekly on twitch or uh you know two or three times a week on youtube we do releases of videos you can check out uh you know the links there you can come comment to talk to us or come chat with us in our discord with that said guys i've been enjoying the shit out of these i hope you are as well if you want to come and chat with me come chat with me if you want to come make fun of me come make fun of me and if you want to spread the love spread the love either way i'm axel and this has been reactions with the next shaman king uh this is going to end it and we'll see you next time